An incredible update now about a local man once in a medically induced coma battling coronavirus. News 6 was there tonight as he arrived home to his family. News 6's Nikki Zizaza is live outside Orlando Health with details on his recovery. Nikki. Ginger Kevin Rathel tells me he is exhausted. He was discharged from Orlando Health after battling the coronavirus. But tonight he's at home with his family after an impromptu welcome home celebration. And his plasma donor tells me it was one he was not going to miss. For this neighborhood in Orlando, masks and social distancing couldn't stop this. A hero's welcome for Kevin Rathel after he says he beat COVID-19. I could actually hear people praying for me while I was in the coma. Wow. Every second, every minute, every day, every hour, I heard prayers. The Orlando father says he spent 18 days in the hospital and at least half the time in the intensive care unit in a medically induced coma. They said you know, he has about a 20% chance left. Praying for a miracle in the form of a plasma donation, his medical team at Orlando Regional Medical Center needed badly. An unlikely donor stepping up and saying the Rathels needed it even more. My friend texted me a picture of Kevin with his family. And the moment I saw that man with his family, you know, it really grabbed my heart and the need went from a general awareness to a very personal awareness. Soon after, the Rathels waited anxiously for the convalescent plasma transfusion believed to show promise work. Kevin? This happened. Baby, yes! Holding my eyes open because I wasn't going to wake up. I heard her. I'm like, leave me alone. A week later, the 52-year-old was wheeled out of the hospital by nurses and support staff heading home. It's a joyous occasion. We are so thrilled to have him finally home. All right, that was News Six's Nikki Zizaza. What an amazing story. I love how he says when he saw the picture of him oh. with his family, he knew what he had to do. For details on how to donate plasma and to see who qualifies, head to clickorlando.com slash coronavirus. You'll see the link inside Nikki's story.